Hi guys, and welcome to another episode of Freelancing Minute. And today, I want to talk about the word focus. Just a few weeks ago, I had coffee with a good friend of mine who was starting his online business. He contacted me because he wanted to share with me a lot of the difficulties that he's facing when starting up his business. And his story goes like this. He had this great idea about writing a book. So he started writing a book. And so he write, he actually planned for three books. And then halfway there, he got an inspiration to start a blog about something. And so he started that blog. And then right in the middle of making that blog, he had this inspiration of starting a devotional uh, activity or writing devotionals for, for people. And so he started it again. And so on and so on until he ended up with a lot of unfinished work. Sounds familiar, right? And perhaps you can relate to that story, right? It might be different for each one of us, but I think that problem was a problem on focus. I was like that when I was starting in my freelance career. Because the problem with me is that I know that I can do a lot of things. I know I can write. I know I can create a website. I know I can do graphic design. I know I can be good at doing presentations. You see, the problem with knowing a lot of things is you don't know what to really focus on. And I think a lot of great freelancers really get stuck with that dilemma of what do I want? What, what kind of service do I want to offer my clients? Or what do I want to focus on? And they end up trying to do a lot of different things without ever having to build a name or ever having to build their brand. So if you are like that, my suggestion is try to zero in on what you really like, what you're really passionate about, and what you want to be known for as a freelancer, and really focus your effort on that. Believe me, because I experienced it myself. Back in 2008, I was trying to do a lot of different things. And in 2010, it took me two years, and it was really hard, and I, I wanted to give up on that on my freelancing career, but it took me two years to really focus on what I would want to do. And as soon as I focused my attention on just making videos, that is when my career started. That is when I grew my business. That is when I became a successful freelancer. So if you want to dream of becoming a great freelancer, focus on one thing that you really want to be good at and serve that to your clients and serve it pretty well. Thanks for watching, and I hope you learned something from this video, and I'll catch you again in the next Freelancing Minute episode. Bye! Hi there, fellow freelancers, and if you like this video that I just shared, please consider subscribing to my channel and sharing it to all of your friends whom you think might benefit from it. Let's help each other, and always remember, let's keep learning. Bye!